Eight on your side team, your outrage following skyrocketing electric bills is forcing the state to make some changes. Consumer reporter Brian Roach explains how you now have more power over how much you pay for electricity. None of us will forget last winter, bitter cold temperatures and astronomically high electric bills that left many of us hot under the collar, especially for customers surprised by variable rate electric bills. The steps that we have outlined in this uh, in these two rulemakings are a needle mover for customers. On Thursday, the Public Utility Commission was defending two new rules that it passed very quickly in the wake of those high electric bills. And I want to assure you, the actions that this commission <coughs> had taken uh, were a direct result of, a, of just a historic run-up in wholesale power prices. The first rule would allow customers to switch electric companies in three to five days instead of the current time frame of 30 to 45 days. The second rule would give consumers easier to understand language about the terms and limits of the contracts they sign with electric suppliers. Customers yearn for more disclosure. And during this hearing, in a move that puzzled some people, the chairman of the State House Consumer Protection Committee appeared to testify against the proposed rule changes. But we just don't think it begins to go, you know, far enough, and it doesn't protect. The consumer. Representative Robert Godshall says there is stronger legislation proposed in the state house to protect electric customers, and he fears the approved rule changes will weaken that proposed legislation. These two rule changes approved by the Independent Regulatory Review Commission will not go into effect immediately, though. The disclosure rule kicks in in 30 days. The accelerated switching rule, most important to consumers, that will not go into effect for at least six months. And the approval of these rule changes today was not a slam dunk round because they were pushed through in one month by the PUC, which is highly abnormal. It usually takes a year to have the rule change go through, so they were expected to be challenged. So it was, uh, it was a little touch and go there for a while as to whether or not these would go through. All right, very good. Thank you, Brian.